Zach Dysart to be an NFL quarterback and a good one, he's going to have to function in the pocket. Dysart's going to get hit and sacked. He can't take that many sacks to be dominant at the next level. What do you think of that number? A lot of them. That's 159 times a smart, big, athletic guy goes down? Yeah. How do you say, how, how does that, how is that? How do you get sacked 159 times? I mean, a lot of different offenses. Okay. I mean, that's not an excuse, but sometimes. Well, my tears, I, I got to wipe the tears out of my eyes. I'm <laughs> sad. <laughs> not an excuse. Okay. Sometimes the uh, line gets a little confused. Played a lot of young guys. Mm -hmm. Had some injuries. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it was a combination of things. And then, yeah. I mean, I got to put some of them on myself, obviously. Not seeing the blitz. Perfect. Trying that's to, all you can do. to make a play. When sacks. Write it down, sacks. 159 of them. If we can prevent three of these. Yep. And make that number 156. Yep. After your first four years in the NFL, I feel like we had a good day here. Exactly. Just make a note, will you? Empty. 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 E-M-P-T-Y. That's what I say. Empty. Empty. That's what we're talking about. I talk about this a lot in college circles because a lot of guys are in it. Just write down code one, code two, and code three. But when you line up like this, when you line up like this in the NFL mm -hmm. with five wides and five blockers, yeah. And Zach Dyson, you think you're going to come into my house without me having an automatic check? No, sir. No, code one is I'm coming after you. I'm going to automatic to a blitz. I tell Erlacher and Briggs they played 15 years. You weren't even born yet. Nope. I say blitz his ass every time he comes out and empty. Automatic to it and drill him. Yep. You got me? Yes, sir. Secondly, I might say let's go code two. Yep. Let's check to a three-man rush. Let's play Tampa two with six underneath. Because I know he's passing, right? Yep. In code three, let's just play what we have called. But that's what a dolt would do. You know why I use that word dolt a lot, D-O-L-T? It's yeah. a stupid fellow. I looked it up in the dictionary. <laughs> I'm not just going to line up and call cover three, cover one, man to man, and have you just shred me. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to automatic to what I want to play against a known passing formation, mm -hmm. right? Yes, sir. Here we are in what formation? Empty. Empty. The mic's right over the center. Yep. You're playing the Massachusetts Minutemen, yep. right? Okay. Yes, and let me ask you, you're, you're, I mean, you're Zach Dicer. They got a code what? Code one. Code one. They're going to have some tricky, tricky blitz plan for you, Dicer, because yes, you're in empty 30 times a game. Yes, sir. Well, just tell me what happened on this. Down goes Dicer. Yep. Well, what the hell are you doing? I mean, I got to ask you. I don't know the ball too long. Didn't see. I didn't see him coming for one thing. You didn't see him coming. Nope. I mean, he's hitting you right on your right shoulder, right under your chin. Player safety, yeah. okay, is a very controversial topic. Yeah. Player safety is going to be an issue if you let these Minutemen come flying through the A gap. Because I don't know what to tell that defensive guy to do right there. Exactly. What happened on this? That was my fault. Okay, so that number should have been 158, right? Yes, sir. But I've seen you make back shoulder throws. I've seen you throw seam balls, quick game in the gun. I've seen you get to the turkey hole. I call it the turkey hole or the dead zone between the corner and the safety. Yeah. Hey, man, that's another turkey hole shot right there against Wisconsin, uh, Northwestern, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's great, Zach. That's outstanding. No problem throwing on the right yes, on sir. the move? Nope. But I'm, I'm showing Dicer make plays in rhythm. Yes? Yes, sir. I'm showing you NFL style of throws that you're making. These are outstanding plays that you're making. But what I want to see you do is shave that number of sacks, right? Yes, sir. 159. You're too good for that. I don't care who you're playing with, right? Yep. But just draw like a, a, a five-man box. Just teach me a couple basic rules in your five-man protection. Because I see you pointing out to Mike or pointing out to Sam. Yep. Tell me how this five-man protection works. I always pointed out the mic. I always indicated who the mic was. And so. what did that mean when you point out the mic? Is that who the center has? Who the, who the offensive line is responsible for? Offensive line, yes, sir. Okay. It might not be the center all the time, but it's definitely going to be the top, the, the, the base five guys. So, say if I pointed out the mic, then the line's got those five guys mm -hmm. hot off the will or hot off the sand, whichever one comes, if yeah. they would come. And then, I, like I said, I had the ability to change the mic. So, in 50... This is our 59 protection. It's our empty protection. We would make the mic most most dangerous guy. 
So if the Sam's walked up over here, I'm going to make the salmon link. Just so I'm Now protected. the line has a new call. They bang to the left. They all three center guard tackle. They fan out there, and you know yes, it's sir. picked up, right? Yes, sir. And then we're hot off Mike at will. My friend did here, number 84. Yep. Look at your friend. You called him back in there. Yep. What word? How do you get him back in there to get him to block? What do uh, you say? Hey, 84. I just tell him to come in. I just give him a little signal. Come in. Come in. And then uh, I can I can t tell him to go stay on the stay on the right here. I can tell him to go to the left side. I can tell him to do whatever. And then we always slid away from the away from the tight end, so he's gonna have the widest guy. So if we're sliding right, it's gonna be Ricky, Ricky, Ricky. If we keep him on the left, we're, we're gonna slide left. It's gonna be Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. Yeah. So I mean, so you brought this guy. You brought numbers. this guy in right here. Yeah. You brought this guy in, and you went Ricky, Ricky, Ricky. Yes, sir. So you said, hey, come on, come on, come on, Ricky, Ricky, Ricky. Yeah. And then you change the route, too, with a hand signal? Uh, sometimes you can change the route. If it if it can be run without the tight end, then we're going to do that. <laughs> I love but that, I mean, Dicer. That's NFL stuff right there. When you recognize the problem, yeah. have an answer for the problem, and That's then cute. rip their ass, I love it, man. Love it. Ahead on Gruden's QB camp. I have.